Fred Bassett. Recently I rediscovered the Fred Bassett comic strip when I chanced upon it on the internet. I was completely blown away. Not only was it totally unfunny like most newspaper comic strips, but it seemed to take kind of a sadistic glee in its own banality. The adventures of our dog Fred have been running in quite a few newspapers since they first appeared in London's Daily Mail on July 8, 1963. <laughs> His creator, Alex Graham, has been dead now for almost nine years. But the Daily Mail and other newspapers around the world have begun rerunning the 9,000 plus Fred Bassett strips he wrote, which will last without interruption until 2023. Faced with 20 more years of a comic strip that sucks humor mercilessly into a dark void, I needed to find out how Alex Graham wrote something so starkly unclever, and yet so popular. The first person I posed this question to was my brother, Andrew Yanda. He's been reading Fred for years. Fred Bassett is sort of metaphysical comedy. It's not, it's not funny because there's a punchline. It's funny because it's so unfunny, you know, you have to look for something else. It's like he's, he's deconstructing the, the comic. Master's home must give him the big welcome. And there's Fred leaping onto his master, and he says, Grr off! I'm afraid I caught him off balance. <laughs> Fred Bassett was starting to get to me. He started to haunt me. Even in my dreams. Fancy a walk? I'm afraid I caught him off balance. Come on, Fred. That's not a punchline. No. Fancy a It was getting to be too much. I decided to take matters into my own hands. Maybe if I took it upon myself to write new punchlines, well, punchlines, for Fred Bassett strips, I would be able to exercise Fred from my psyche. First I tried to give him a more rebellious edge. Then I just had him swear a lot. Having Fred say, holy shit I'm stupid was a favorite of mine. But I think that if, if Alex Graham had his druthers he would have written fuck it for every punchline, or fuck you, or... Maybe I'm missing the point of Fred Bassett, really missing the point, but I'll have plenty more time to try and figure it out, because I don't think Fred is going anywhere anytime soon. <laughs>